the special needs account was formed in 1999 by the district social workers. Um, it has allowed us to uh, provide for the neediest students um, in our district. Uh, through this account, we've been able to um, help students with clothing, hygiene items. Uh, we've helped the parents uh, to pay for co-pays. Um, at ut offered utility assistance to these families and without this account um, none of this would have been possible. They've helped where I haven't had the funds to be able to get my kids some pants, shoes, jackets. Um, family hasn't had the money. I've had a call quite often because of it. We have needs that come up all the time on our campus, um, anywhere from head lice to laundry detergent to underwear for our kids. Um, and so I am able to come down here and pick up anything that we need for our kids on our campus. It's such a blessing just to be able to have like a one-stop shop instead of having to run from place to place to try to find funding for this or that. So it's really, it really has helped me immensely being on a campus. The only funding source for this account has been through generous donations of staff here at the Ed Center. Um, staff solicit donations or make or buy things to donate for the raffle and uh, then they purchase tickets every year. So for the past 16 years, staff have raised over $32,000 for this account. And that's our only fundraiser for this account. So we really appreciate everyone that has uh, donated or bought tickets. A few years ago, the account was in jeopardy. We found out that the district should not have that type of account. And so luckily, uh, Cheryl Papan and the Wichita Falls Foundation, ISD Foundation came through and uh, started to support the account and has picked it up and it's really made things run smoother and easier and we really appreciate Cheryl and and the foundation for uh, sponsoring this account. We also really want to thank Lanny Evans for her many years of support for this program. She has spearheaded and basically run the program from top to bottom. Um, her office is always full of items and she has people coming in and out all day long during the month of December and we really appreciate all the work she's done the past few years, uh, past many years and I'm going to really miss her when she retires and we want to thank all of y'all for buying tickets and uh, supporting this account for the past 16 years and from here forward. <laughs>